guys welcome back to my channel hope you guys are having a wonderful 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 day um today i am having a seafood boil and in my seafood boil i just have some potatoes some snow crab and some eggs um hope you guys got something good to eat i am so hungry i'm gonna go ahead and start eating because i am tray hungry i just got this out of the oven so I'm ready to get crack a lacking. Come on, pop right for me. Pop right for me. It's not popping right for me, guys. Why? Mmm. So good. Wow. So delicious. I'm so happy with this crab. I went and got this crab from the food truck, and um, the person that I got the food truck, the crab from, um, is actually on, um, on Facebook, and um, she's like a traveling um, seafood truck. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And the seafood is so delicious, as you guys can see. So good. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I would not steer you guys wrong, but it's so hard, as you guys know, my my friends in the mukbang community, mm. how hard it is to get some good crab. And it's just kind of like, when you can't get the good crab, it just kind of turns you off for a minute. You're like, oh my God, you know? I wish I had some good crab. And you're just trying to do your video and just, you know, just kind of muffling through it. And you're like, oh my God, I know this crab is not good, but I'm trying to do this video. Mm. I hate to have to do that. Mm. I really just not do the video. And then have to pretend like my food is good when it's not. It's just that. Sometimes the crab that you get is just not good. So, yeah, but this place that I'm telling you guys about, oh my goodness, they have the best. They have like um, the crab legs. You have Dungeness crab. Mm. And I've had the Dungeness crab. It's really good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my God, so um, they have mussels, they have alligator, um, they have, um, they have scallops, um, what else do they have? They have so much. I'm going to go ahead and put the menu, I'm going to post it on this video as well, mm. so you guys can see what they have. So delicious. Now, I'm going to shout out my friends down in Alabama, the Choo Choo Truck, which sent me a picture of her view of some palm trees. I'm going to get her for that. <laughs> she sent me a picture of some palm trees and said my view. I was like, man, I tell you, Alabama. I was thinking about going to Alabama on vacation this year, but oh my God, that drive, <laughs> that drive, guys, when I looked it up, it's like about 12 hours, mm. Mm. and where my friend is, she's actually not that far from Pensacola, Florida, <clears throat> so I know it's some beautiful beaches there. But sister just don't want to do that drive. It's not like I have a lot of days off either. It's just, you know, the Thanksgiving holiday. So I'm going to have to reschedule that. But yeah, guys. Comment below. Have you guys went on vacation in the midst of everything that's going on? Let me know below. It's just kind of hard. Like, you want to go places, but at the same time, it's like, uh 
got to kind of pump the brakes. <laughs> Yeah, vacation is good though. Sometimes you just need a minute to just <clears throat> just wind down, just kind of de stress. I'm kind of like in one of those moods today, but it's like you know, sometimes when you're down and you're feeling like you're just not really in a good mood or whatever, God just sends somebody to just you know make you you know, feel a little bit better. And that happened to me today. And I bless God for that. Um, um, yeah, I just have a couple friends that, you know, made me feel much better today, you know? So I appreciate you. Appreciate you for being there for me. Cause sometimes you just need some encouraging, you know, you can encourage yourself all day and all night, but Sometimes it's good to, you know, God send those people down and say, hey, you know, I got you. I see you. I feel your pain. And I got you. Mm. Such a wonderful feeling. So, hey, guys. <clears throat> I want to talk to you about my sugar, my sugar fast. And, um. And I'm not really just doing a sugar fast. I'm doing like a sugar um, change, the lifestyle change. Um, the reason I'm not doing sugar is because it seems like to me I was always in pain. My knees always hurt all the time. And it was only like when I was taking in sugar too much sugar. So I was like, you know what? It's the sugar, you know? And I was like, you know, the courage to, to do it was the hard part, you know, but I'm 15 days in guys, 15 days, 15 days in. It looks so good. And, um, so I just encourage you guys, mm, if you're having like back pain or knee pain or any type of, you know, ailments in your body, try to reduce your sugar. See if that helps, you know, because I'll let you know that it worked for me, you know, and it's continued to work for me. And I have dropped some pounds. And like I said, I'm not really, I'm, I am kind of doing it to drop some pounds too, but mostly for the overall, the way that I feel. And so I don't know. You know, just to be transparent, you know, to some people because this is a platform. So we might as well go ahead and keep it real. I suffer with the boils and all that. And they come in the oddest of places, if you know what I mean. And so I think that's from the sugar as well. And so, um, you know, I've noticed that, you know, since I haven't been taking in the sugar. And I'm going to let you guys know the sugar that I take in. Since we being honest. Since we friends. I love slushies. Oh my God, that's my weakness. I love slushies. And so, I would give me a slushie after work. And baby, go to town. And um, I like cookies. I like pecan pies. You know, and, you know, different things like that. So, with me doing this um, sugar, um, no sugar diet, you know, it's just really, you know, it's taking a lot from me, you know, because I don't have, you know, I can't eat, you know, so many different things, you know, like the slushies and a cold Pepsi, a cold Dr. Pepper with a lot of ice, you know, all those things, so good. But when you know that you just, at the point where you just can't take it anymore, I was at that point. Mm. I was weighing more than I had ever weighed before. And um, I was just not feeling good at all. I'm just keeping it real. Because I feel like, you know, 
we got to keep it real on this platform because, you know, we're here for a purpose. And if I can help somebody, you got to keep it real. So, yeah, guys, if you guys want to join me, you know, DM me, private message me mm, on any other platforms. You can reach me on Facebook. You can reach me on Instagram. You can even reach me on TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> and living my blessed life. That's me. And um, I post on Facebook every day. And I think I might um start posting like some encouraging quotes, you know, just so we can keep you know one another motivated. And you guys can motivate me and help me too. By leaving little messages. Keep it up. Keep going. You know. Messages like that. That helps out so much. Because it's not easy. Because some, some days I have like cravings for juice and things like that. And I know, you know, once I get started, if I start, you know, with some juice. Or if I start with, you know, something small, it'll lead to something else. So. My trick is. If I do have a sweet tooth, I want something sweet, I'll grab a piece of fruit. And um, I do that. So I might, um, for the holiday, I think I told you guys this before, just start doing like some smoothies or something like that. Maybe when everybody's eating pecan pie or cakes or pound cakes or whatever they're eating. Mm. I'll give me a smoothie and um, keep it up. I just want to keep it up. And that's the truth. Mm. This is so delicious, guys. So my nephew's birthday is Friday. So I'm making him a seafood um, bag. Crab. Dungeness crab. Onions and potatoes and all that stuff. And some turkey sausage because he likes the turkey sausage. So, happy birthday, Don Don. TT got you. <laughs> he said he gonna eat that joint for for breakfast. <laughs> he said he gonna eat his crab for breakfast. I said I heard that. <laughs> I ain't mad at you. I ain't mad at you. I love crab too. I'll be eating it for breakfast. Mm -hmm. mm. But we have to give people their roses when they're here. And I have to give Dada his props because he's a young man, my nephew. They grew up without his dad. And he is out there trying. He is out there seriously trying to make it happen. So, shout out to you, Don Don. He watched my show. And he always tried to encourage me. And I appreciate it. I'm trying to get him to start his own show. I'm like, you need to start your own show. He's like, yeah, I think I might do that. So, you might see him out there. Doing his thing. Yeah. Oh, God, I just wanted to come and share my seafood with you guys. It's so delicious. I'm sitting up here so you guys can see. So delicious. Yes. Hope you guys had something that you guys like to eat today. Oh, excuse me. So good. Um, yes treat yourself guys we work hard we go we going through so much treat yourself you know because life is just not easy like i said before i was having like not so good day today i'm feeling kind of down you know but god is great and I appreciate his goodness, you know. 
And you know, God will send people from places you like, where they come from? You know what I mean? Where'd that hood come from? Or, you know, he just sent love from somewhere. Like, like I, I heard you, I saw you, I heard you crying, you know, and I got you. So yeah, guys, be encouraged in the midst of, in the midst of everything that we're going through, be encouraged. All right, guys. This was truly delicious. Mm. Some brown eggs. If you guys haven't had brown eggs, get some brown eggs in your life. So delicious. They will not disappoint. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I must have been hungry because I think I ate like three or four eggs. I had a taste for these eggs today. I'm good with this butter. I got some slap your mama in there and some garlic salt and some um, Land O'Lakes butter. So delicious. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and let you guys go. I appreciate you. I love you. Thank you for to my new subscribers. Make sure you like, comment, share me out to your family and friends. And until next time, happy eating.